Hey y'all, Love Biscuit here, and this is Personal Time with Biscuit. Um, I'm not sure what you guys are seeing on the screen right now because I haven't decided yet, so we'll find out. It's probably going to be Black Ops Combat Training. I haven't really played a whole lot. Now, I'm going to start off by saying um, I've had two big blows in my life the past few months. Like two, so more like a couple. <laughs> and it's, I don't know, they've been big. The first one I'm not going to talk about just because I don't want to. The second one, um, I actually <laughs> was in the doctor's office and they ended up calling me about a week later telling me that I was going to have some biopsies done. And that's kind of scary. And then, you know, I had to wait a while for them to finally make that appointment. But then when they made that appointment, it was like three days later that I was going to have it done. So, um, it's, it's really scary. And so I went in and I had three biopsies done. Uh, well, technically four because they screwed up the first one. But, um, and, you know, it was painful. And, um, really uncomfortable for the past couple of days. And I don't want to hear, oh, well, you're just a pussy, you can't, you can't handle pain. Dude, I can handle pain just fine. I was in the delivery room with my daughter, you know, pushing her out, and I was laughing and making jokes and stuff with the nurses. So, if you are some boy, and you are going to say that, I don't want you to say it until you've had a rock the size of a pea come out of your pee hole while you've been laughing and giggling, okay? Okay, now back to it. <laughs> it was painful uh, when it happened, and then it's just been kind of uncomfortable since then. There's been moments, like, if I've been on my feet too long, I totally know. And um, the first day, I was pretty much just laid on the couch, didn't do anything. The second day... Um, you know, I was sitting up and walking around and doing some other stuff, but I couldn't do a whole lot because I would notice. And um, I was trying to get my daughter's schoolwork and stuff around, and I just, I don't know, it got painful a few times I had to go lay down. And it kind of sucked. But um, it was just, it was more uncomfortable than really painful. I mean, I have migraines fairly regularly, so I know pain. Along with the fact that I've had, a, you know, a child come out of the birth canal. I didn't know how else to say that. But anyway, so I know pain. Um, it was painful when it happened. It was more uncomfortable after. And um, it's just not, not a lot of fun. And I'm not really going to talk about where I have these biopsies done or anything. That's kind of personal. Yeah. Plus, most of you guys are guys, so you wouldn't understand. But you girls, you might. <laughs> um, I am under 30 years old. And I never thought, you know possible cancer, possible cancer in my future, pre-cancer, or anything else was going to be in my near future. Or now. It might even be now. Who knows? And it's scary. It really is. So, you know, I have, uh, we have plans in place for whatever happens. And um, they're actually, I had this done Monday. So two weeks from Monday, they're going to call me and let me know what they found and, or what the plan is. And That'll be great. <laughs> the only problem is I'm actually going to be in, on vacation. I'm going to be back home in Ohio. Um, right now I live in California. And I have to say, you know, yay, California. <laughs> I really prefer the country. I love the country. The only difference is I do not get this high-speed internet out in the country. So, you know, it's like... I really love my high-speed internet. <laughs> I also, out in the country, you do not have fast food so readily available. <laughs> and so it kind of sucks. But what I dislike is I'm going to be home trying to enjoy my time home with my family, and I'm going to be worried. And then they're going to call, and it can go either way. It can be a, like, oh, okay, well, we have a plan, so let's do that. Because regardless of what happens, there's still going to be a plan in place for the fact that, you know, there could be possible cancer in the future or otherwise. So... I'm going to have to be monitored regardless. So, it's just scary. And, um, this all happened around the time that I stopped playing, <laughs> um, Black Ops Combat Training. Because you guys know how excited I was about it and how much I was in love with it. Yeah! I still like it, I just haven't really played it. I played some Borderlands while I was stuck on the couch. I had fun with that and I'm really looking forward to it too. The only problem is, I'm going to be gone. It comes out the day before I fly home. <laughs> So I don't even know if I'm going to bother picking it up until I get back. I don't know. I haven't decided. Plus, I don't think GameStop holds, holds them that long. I don't know. Maybe I can talk to them. I'm there enough. They know me by name. <laughs> but, um, yeah. So, 
I've been dealing with that and I have to say this is actually really therapeutic talking about it. This is probably like my third take of this. It is pretty therapeutic and you know it's nice and I guess that if something bad happens at least you guys are sort of keyed in right? <laughs> I don't know. I'm just um I'm gonna be trying to get more stuff to you guys soon. I'm, I'm getting in a better mindset. You know, I've been kind of down, and most of the videos you guys have seen have been old. You know, like, it took me a while to get The Walking Dead done, and then I still didn't get it to you guys until well after I'd already had, you know, stuff done. <laughs> or at least new, so. I wasn't my typical self in those videos either, and all of Guild Wars was done before. So, I'm hoping to get some more of everything to you guys, you know, more Black Ops and things like that. I'm sorry I cannot get into Modern Warfare 3, just sucks. But anyways, guys, I think I'm going to go ahead and close up this personal time with Biscuit. <laughs> um, I'm Love Biscuit, and I'll talk to you guys soon.